What's up guys, welcome back to Gresh Fishing. In today's video, just come down on the kayak and um, yeah, we're gonna see what's around. It's just been flooding and I, I didn't expect to catch anything, but I've already hooked up to two fish, so may as well make a video out of it. So let's get into the video. Oh, also, like and subscribe. Alrighty. So, just come down today. I don't know why I decided to bring big lures, but I brought big lures. You should really, um, after a flood, once again, slim down all your presentations, go really small. But um, yeah, I decided to get some bigger presentations and um, give them a go. See what's around. Um, yeah, I wasn't expecting to catch anything, just testing out the bony swim and everything like that. But um, yeah, started catching a few fish, so I decided to make a video. If I can catch more, I've only had two hits and um, they weren't very big fish. One was a little flathead and the other one, I don't know what that one was, but yeah, we'll see what we can do. Worst comes to worst, it doesn't become a video when um, I've had a good afternoon fishing. Yeet. Right up onto the shallows. See what's in the shallowy depths first, and then we'll work my way up to the deep section. Looks like there's a bit of wind where I want to get to next. Just not good, it's not good at all. If it's gonna take a good day. Well, I got my rod and I got my bait. All I gotta do is sit here and wait for the fish to bite and come my way. Now I just gotta wait for day. Oh, yep. Whoa. What are you? Oh. That's a big fish. Oh, holy moly. That's a giant fish. He's throwing me down river. Not good, not good. Don't run at me. Oh, that's a big fish. Is that another big flathead? Oh, big dewy. Yes, big dewy. Big soapy. Oh. oh, I won't even fit in my net. Oh no. Oh, don't snap my rod. Woo! Yes! Oh, that is exactly what we came here for, boys and girls. <laughs> yes! Oh my lordy lord, that is a big fish. We'll get him up. We'll get a look at him. Let's there you go, guys. Absolutely. Scoff down that little Daiwa prawn. What an awesome dewy. Look at that guys. Oh, bit of sliding. But that dewy from the zero, all the way to 64. You could argue about 60. Hot <laughs> water fish, just on that little Daiwa prawn. Absolutely stoked. Let's get back in the drink. Oh, right next to the kaya. Let's get this big dewy back in the drink. Holy crap. They're a powerful fish, eh? Super powerful. Oh, oh. Let me leave that golden. Oh. Let's go, big girl. Yeah, he's a beautiful fish. Oh. Well, definitely can't say I was expecting that today. That was the little Daiwa prawn that got it done on a 1 6. BP. Uh, TTs. TT jigad. What an awesome fish. Hopefully we can catch a few more. There's a few more fish scooting around just behind me as well. So get back in the water and um, let's see if we can catch some more dewies. For the people that have never caught a dewey before, they are a super, they're super not hardy. So they're not like your carp and everything that you can have out of the water for ages. They need a lot of water and um, yeah, you've got to hand, if you catch one, you've got to handle them really quickly. Otherwise, they don't do too well going back in the water. But I handled that fish very well for how big it was and um, how excited I was. So, stoked to get him back in the drink. You don't want to keep those sort of fish because they're the future. They're the future big ones that you're going to catch. But um, anyway, I'm going to keep fishing and let's catch them all. Oh, stoked with that. Anyone would be as happy as me if they caught a fish like that in a little creek system. That was just magical. Um, but yeah, we're just going to keep on 
flicking out. Hopefully we can get a few more good fish. If not, I'm I'm stoked. That's that's my day done. Stoked with that fish. And to, to get that in the middle of the day, it's like nearly two o'clock and I've just got an absolute giant that you'd normally get at night time. So very stoked and um let's keep fishing. Oh, had a bit of GoPro troubles then. Didn't know what was going on with it. All right now, well, at least for the time being. Oh, big eagle. Come to wish me good luck in my fishing adventure. Every time I see a big eagle, I end up catching big fish. Hopefully he sticks around. If I caught a flat it, I'd feed it to him or a brim. No! Drop the fish. <sighs> Missed another Joey. Not good. Don't want to miss him. You want to get him? Something tells me my tail's tangled up again. We love it. Not really. I don't know. Just got some weird weight on the end of my lure then. Must have picked up a bit of leaf litter from the bottom. Whoa. Okay, Chief. He's running towards me. What are you? Another little soapy. You ran super hard for your size. Jesus Christ. <laughs> He's tiny compared to our first one. Let's go, another Jew. Well, there we go, guys. <laughs> another nice little Jewy. Just on that little um, Daiwa prawn lure. I have to get the name of it because. It is carving up. I'm about to go into a tree, so um, what a great fish. <laughs> Let's get him off and then back into the drink. Oh. Well, not as big as the last one, but <laughs> still a very nice fish. See you later, bud. Oh. <laughs> All right, I guess I'll cop that for catching him, but what an awesome fish. I've seen this lure a lot lately, all on YouTube and everything, and um, honestly, it's Coming one of my favourite lures for these Jewies, absolutely popping off. All right, let's see what else we can catch. Holy crap! Did you guys see how freaking hard that fish went? For its size, it, it pretty much went as hard, just as hard as that um 65 centimeter Jew. Yeah. So as always, using my X Bride, um, the 2610 ML model, and my 2500 um, twin power. And I've got Shimano Braid, 16 pound and 9 pound leader. So I'm catching some pretty good fish on light line. Two Jewies. Nothing else. Oh, I did get that flattered off camera before I decided to make a video. But for a video that wasn't meant to be a video, this is pretty cool. Just catching whatever's cruising by. So here's a little lure here, it's a little prawn imitation, it's called prawn, but it's uh, by Bait Junkie and I'm using the lemongrass UV and um, yeah, just absolutely carving up these fish. Uh, I've been seeing it all over YouTube and everything, so um, I knew it had to be good, but never had a packet and the, uh, the other day I decided to pick one up and yeah, it's going great today. Fish on. Oh, I thought I was a stingray then. Oh, I was pooping myself. <laughs> but no, little baby flattered. 
You see how that stick popped up? There you go guys, nice little flathead, just on that Daiwa lure again. <laughs> Stoked with him, just popping it along a little sand, mud flat. Beautiful colours. Alright, we'll get him off. Uh, he was super feisty coming in the kayak, he didn't want to do anything. See you later bud. Oh, there goes my finger. Wow, this little lure has really been popping off today. Oh, what an amazing session that was. A 65 centimetre Jew, another Jew, and a few flathead can't complain using the new bait junkie prawn lure in the lemongrass uv absolutely awesome um let me make sure to leave a like subscribe comment and i'll catch you in the next adventure